Welcome back to my channel. Hi, hello if you're new here and for today's video I'm going to be telling you how I make tea. I use the Breville One Cup dispenser. This is a kettle basically that dispenses water so you don't burn yourself. So the reason why I got the One Cup dispenser was after my eye operation which I will talk, which I do talk about in a video which I will link down below. I'm not getting into it now, you'll see in the video. Um, so I do recommend you go and watch th that video after you watch this one, of course. Um, and basically I found myself not being able to pour um, water into a cup to make a cup of tea or coffee or whatever it is you know um, I either felt the cup too high or felt it too low or you know like it just spilt everywhere so um, a solution uh, to this problem was to to get the one cup dispenser uh, mom saw it in the catalogue and she said that it would help me um, because you set it to the right setting for yourself um, basically and it does the work for you um, and it's as easy as anything to use and you'll never have any problems again and she was completely right um, as I never had any problems since so let me just talk you through um, basically the, the one cup dispenser before I do the mini tutorial so basically you open the lid the flip lid and you then fill up the dispenser you then obviously close the flip lid um, you then um, decide between the different levels of cup size the different cup sizes you want um, there is the the large the medium and the small and there is also two intermediates there is intermediate between um, the small and the medium and medium and large and they're just represented by little dots so um, then you would press the big dial button um, and you then the whole thing will light up the little water section I'm gonna call it will light up also the top of the machine lights up to let you know that you've put it on and then um, there is a little X button now you can press that X button at any time that's to stop the machine um, you can stop the machine at any time Excuse me. Um, such as when it's boiling, or when you when it's filling up the cup. And with that all being said, let's get to the tutorial. This is the, what the Breville One Cup dispenser looks like. It's got the dial, which also is the button to turn it on. This is the X button, which you can press to stop proceedings at any time. Um, it comes in one colourway, I believe, and it, this is the metal plate that clips in here. So it just clips in there. So let's see what it can do. Since this machine has medium and large and small settings, for this demo, I'm using jugs. So this is how you open the Breville one cup dispenser. You have this thing here and you open it with one hand. And this is where you fill. This is what you do to fill it up. You get the water and you pour it in to the machine. As you can see, it's pretty much all the way full. I don't fill it this high, but for this demonstration, I will. In the small cup first, um, small jug for the first demo. And what you do is that's the large cup. You point the arrow, you spin the dial at which of the settings you want, and now the magic happens. Whereas you press it, and this is what happens it lights up, that lights up, and it will boil just like a kettle. And now we wait. 
It's nearly done. So we just wait and look what happens. you'll get in a small cup. I know the jug is slightly big but it's just as a sample. You'll notice that the water is still high in the machine so it hasn't used that much up which is great. Now I'm using the medium sized jug. So I've got to set the machine to a medium size which is in the middle. And it's pretty straightforward to use um, this machine with the dials and things like that because usually when you have dials on a machine it's very intricate and difficult to use because sometimes you may accidentally spin it too, too quickly and it ends up going a certain way and it doesn't go to the setting that you want. But with this one, it's very, very straightforward. So again, we put it on. And this is how much water you'll get in a medium sized mug. So I just wanted to show you that this jug is way too big to sit like this. So what you have to do is you have to go under the nozzle like so for mugs that don't fit. But it fits every mug. So this is the large jug. So what we're going to do is we're going to set it to the final large mug setting. So we're going to press and again. Now I'm gonna show you how the X button works. Say you wanna stop the whole thing, you press it down and it will automatically stop proceedings. And you're done. Look at how much water you get in the large mug. And that's quite a bit of water. I started to feel that these look practically the same to you. So for example, I'm going to pour the contents of this into a coffee cup. For the large mug. That's how much water is in the large cup. So that's it for this tutorial. I hope you liked it. Now I've got a couple of questions for you. Do you like the Bravo One Cup Dispenser? Tell me why or tell me why you don't. And how would this product be effective in your life? For me, if I was to write a comment, I would say this product is effective in my life as I'm visually impaired and it helps me out as to not burn myself when I'm making a cup of tea. What do you think? So that's it for this video guys. If you liked it don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and don't forget to follow me on my social medias which will be as always down below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!